Last April, Wyandotte Roosevelt's Jake Timmerman was diagnosed with stage 2 Hodgkin's lymphoma. But Jake only had one thing on his mind. Hockey. My mom, we asked her when she walked in the room, you know, she goes, what's wrong, what's wrong? Because I was in tears and I go, I'm going to miss a year of hockey because that's uh, the treatment time was supposed to take about a year, they said. So that was probably just punching the gut right there, you know, that's what I was most upset about. I didn't want to get better, I just wanted to play hockey. The community responded immediately, doing everything they could during his multiple rounds of chemotherapy. I say community and that's that's probably the right word to use because it hasn't been just, you know, wind out hockey or, you know, just wind out itself. It's been downriver, you know, all the schools downriver. The great people of wind out, it was unreal. I mean we, we did fundraisers, we did very well. You had other hockey teams at the fundraisers helping and and you know it just and you really realize what it's all about after that. And it was all about the team. We came up with the slogan Team 35. You know, where that came from, it was just half of 70 last year, we were Team 70. So we figured, you know, he's 35 and we're gonna do 35 strong. And we got bracelets made up and shirts and, and uh, you know, it, it really rallied the whole group together. So they call themselves Team 35, 35 strong. They've been saying that from the beginning. And uh, sometimes you don't really realize it, but you kind of, you step back for a second, you look and you realize, you know, that, you know, you got everybody, you know, rallying around you and, you know, wanting to push you and you know make you better. And Jake did get better, making his season debut just a few weeks ago. I remember I um, we got to the rink, you know, before we the team left on the buses and uh, they go, oh, turn around you're starting. And I kinda looked at it and I was like, I'm starting against Berkeley, you know, it's a division two school. I was kinda surprised, you know, I go, maybe I'm more ready than I think I am, but uh, it definitely got me going. I was you know, I was nervous, obviously, very nervous. Happy with my performance and uh, couldn't ask really for anything better, you know, the way the team was. Everybody, all the guys were happy and excited, you know, with, uh, with the win. Truly an inspiration. For State Champs, I'm Stephanie Funkhauser.